Well, a very good evening to you on what is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is uh, barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of uh, excitement and expectation. One glance and you know where we are. It is one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Kylian Mbappe. There's nothing more frightening for a defender when he's running at you at full speed. He gets into his stride so quickly and seems to just glide across the turf. But when the goal's in front of him, he's also got that cool head that's required to... to... So it's away we go then. Oh, it's a searing run. He is a man on a mission. Dagba drives it in. Dagba, not one to pass up the chance to run up the defence. He loves those duels. It opened up really nicely when the defence got all tentative then. Uh, they were cautious in making contact, but safe in numbers. Out again for a throw-in. It's Lasna. Lasne kicks it out wide. Keeps everyone guessing. Great leap! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Paris Saint-Germain can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Marco Verratti. Mbappe. Paredes, Marco Verratti, can't get the better of his opposite number. Mbappe really was well marshalled there because he was denied the opportunity to, to turn. I needed a better pass there. Forward it goes. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Oh, that's not going to go down too well with his teammates. And here's Mauro Icardi. Mbappe. He's left his man. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Tries to get it clear. Wijnaldum, Paris Saint-Germain still to register a shot on target. Mauro Icardi! A real chance and a real let-off. Quickly. Gets away from his opponent. Mbappe. Danger averted for now. Out for a throw. No messing about, just bludgeoned away. And it's Vinaldum. Now it's Berati. Now it's he's gone for it! It's a carbon copy of the previous miss. Paris Saint-Germain really putting a few chances together here. Taking one can only add to such good momentum now. Messi, a regular corner taker. 
and it's been taken short. Messi. Paredes. Good ball. He's had a goal! Goal! Paris Saint-Germain! The breakthrough strike! Oh, high-quality goal. Lovely first touch. Sumptuous second. Paris Saint-Germain break the deadlock. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Good idea, just poorly executed. He's through. Gets into some space. Goes for the cross. Gets good distance on it. Now it's messy. A decent ball and his big chance and Messi! Oh, how's that for a goal? Oh, it really is a finish of the highest order. Hot knife through butter. They have done it again. It just came down to a battle of wills between him and the keeper, and he won it with a cracking piece of trickery. Paris Saint-Germain have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now, the only doubt is how many is coming. Brest have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Verratti does well to read it and intercepts. And here's Mauro Icardi. Mauro Icardi! And it's Messi. Oh, good. Mbappe! And it's there! And they're at it again in double quick time. Reflections on the goal? Yeah, anything that's hit low with real pace like that makes it so much harder for the keeper. I mean, he's never going to get to that. without reply this is becoming a stroll well unsurprisingly Peter the opposition look completely stunned I'm not sure they can gather themselves Lasne plays it forward and it's played forward Mbappe tries to head towards goal hoists it forward now the counter the message is clear, none shall pass. Mbappe, here's Mauro Icardi. And he heaves it forward. Forward it goes. It's anyone's ball. It's 
Ralph's gone out for a throw in. A really good feat. That intervention was very necessary. And that'll be the last act of the first half. As easy as one, two, three. It really has been that straightforward halfway through the match, but very little to suggest that much will change over the second half. Peter, do I really need to say anything, or can I simply refer you to the scoreline? Paris Saint-Germain have established themselves in a position of absolute supremacy. An action-packed 45 minutes, and they have raced into a three-goal lead. So we're just settling back into this second half. Reported a change to either side during the break. How many interceptions have we seen now? Someone's got to up the quality and, and set an example. That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Breaks on here. Paredes. And here's Mauro Icardi. Icardi proving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Oh, that's a fine challenge. Keep defending, albeit from an unexpected source. You have to admire commitment like that, because he could easily ignore that and just kind of walk around and let others do all the chasing, but instead, he looks as if he relishes the chance to, uh, to dig in for his team here. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Icardi is effectively being marked out of the game here. Well, there's certainly a, a coordinated attempt to shut him down. That's a pop! And in it goes! Yet another goal in an awesome performance! They are in complete charge! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Messi showed real composure then. I mean, how often do you see a player do everything right until he gets into the box and only to completely kind of fluff the finish? Not him. His second of the game, and an eye now for the hat trick. Paris Saint-Germain totally rampant here. And it's played forward. Mounier needed to come up with a better ball. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, needless to say, he was expecting a better ball than that. Kimpembe. Paredes. Vijnaldum. Dagba. He gets past his man. Messi. That has been clubbed away. Just brushed off the ball there. Hoists it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Uh, he acknowledges that he's... Oh, he's caught him there, it's a free kick. Well, that was just asking too much of himself from there. And that has put pay to that. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Icardi unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Lasnik. 
into the last quarter of an hour. It's a brilliant interception. Paredes. Chance to break. And it's Icardi. Oh, some tackle that. Here's Mauro Icardi. And it's played forward. Forward it goes. He's coming hard. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right. And he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Mbappe. Pierre Gabriel cuts it out. And the counter is on. Fifth. Pierre Gabriel tries to get it forward quickly. Kimpembe. Paredes. Decent progress down the left. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. And it's played forward. Too much on it, and that's the keepers. Verratti set up one. Added time is up, and there goes the whistle. Paris Saint-Germain, comfortable winners. A virtuoso display, utterly one-sided. How would you summarise what we've seen today, then, Jim? Paris Saint-Germain simply imposed their strength from start to finish, and this became as predictable as predictable.